Welcome to our channel. Today we're diving into the world of hacking with the top commands you absolutely need to know. These aren't just some random Linux commands, we're talking about the tools used by security professionals and yes, even black hat hackers to explore the depths of networks and systems. We're all about ethical hacking here, using this knowledge for good to protect ourselves and our data. Think of it like learning how to pick a lock, not so you can break into houses, but so you can understand how to better secure your own. So buckle up, smash that like button for the algorithm, and let's get our hands dirty with some seriously powerful hacking commands. Before we unleash the Kraken, let's talk about why these commands are so important. Imagine you're a digital detective. You wouldn't show up to a crime scene without your trusty magnifying glass. These commands are your tools in the digital world. They let you see what's really going on. Ready to dive in? Let's get started. First up, we've got Nmap, the network mapper extraordinaire. This bad boy is like the Swiss army knife of network scanning, giving you the power to see what devices are on a network, what ports they're using, and even what operating system they're running. Imagine you're connecting to a public Wi-Fi network. Do you really know who else is on that network or what they're up to? Nmap can help you find out. With a simple command like Nmap target IP address, you can get a basic overview of what's connected. Want to get more specific? Nmap has a ton of options for scanning specific ports, searching for vulnerabilities, and even identifying the services running on a device. It's like having X-ray vision for your network, letting you see everything that's going on behind the scenes. Just remember to use your powers for good, Spidey. Next up is Netcat, often shortened to NC, and trust me, this little command is deceptively powerful. We're talking about a tool so versatile it can read and write data to network connections, open back doors, perform port scanning, and even transfer files. It's like the duct tape of networking tools. You can use it for almost anything. Want to test if a specific port is open on a remote server? Netcat can do that. Need to send data from one machine to another? Netcat's got your back. Heck, you can even use Netcat to set up a basic chat server between two computers. But in the right hands, Netcat is an incredibly valuable tool for network troubleshooting, security testing, and even just playing around with network concepts. Just remember, with great power, you know the drill. Hold on to your hats, folks, because things are about to get serious. We're talking about Metasploit, the big daddy of penetration testing frameworks. This isn't just a single command, it's a whole suite of tools designed to test the security of systems and applications. Think of it like a hacker's playground with everything you need to find and exploit vulnerabilities. We're talking about pre-built exploits, payloads, and tools for everything from reconnaissance to post-exploitation. With Metasploit, you can simulate real-world attacks to see how your systems hold up. You can find vulnerabilities, gain access to systems, and even escalate your privileges. That's why it's absolutely crucial to only use Metasploit on systems you own or have explicit permission to test. But in the right hands, Metasploit is an invaluable tool for security professionals and ethical hackers to improve the security of our digital world. Just remember, with great power, you get the idea. Ever wonder what your computer is actually sending and receiving over the network? Enter Wireshark the network protocol analyzer that lets you capture and inspect every single packet of data flowing through your network. Imagine being able to eavesdrop on the conversations happening between your computer and the internet. That's what Wireshark lets you do. You can see what websites you're visiting, what data you're sending, and even what other devices on your network are up to. But it's still an incredibly powerful tool for troubleshooting network issues, analyzing network performance, and even debugging applications. Think of it like a network microscope, allowing you to zoom in and see the intricate details of how data moves across the network. So the next time you're having network problems, don't just blindly restart your router fire up Wireshark and see what's really going on. Let's be honest, we've all forgotten a password at some point, but what if you could crack that forgotten password? John the Ripper tests billions of combinations per second to recover lost passwords. Remember, using it without permission is illegal and unethical. For security pros, it's a tool to test password strength and find weak links. It guesses original passwords from hashed versions, so choose strong, unique passwords for your accounts. Hold on tight because we're about to unleash the Hydra, 
a powerful password cracking tool that can target a wide range of services, from SSH and FTP to web forms and databases. Unlike John the Ripper, which focuses on cracking hashed passwords, Hydra specializes in brute force attacks trying different username and password combinations until it finds the right one. Imagine a thousand monkeys banging on a thousand keyboards, that's kind of what Hydra does, but much, much faster. That's why it's crucial to only use Hydra on systems you own or have explicit permission to test. But in the right hands, Hydra is a valuable tool for security professionals to test the strength of their authentication systems and identify weak points that could be exploited by attackers. Just remember, with great power, you know the drill. Ever wonder how secure your Wi-Fi network really is? Aircrack Ng is the answer. It's a suite of tools designed to assess the security of Wi-Fi networks, and it's a favorite among security enthusiasts and ethical hackers. With Aircrack Ng, you can capture Wi-Fi packets, analyze network traffic, and even crack WEP and WPA PSK keys, depending on the network's configuration and your patience. Think of it like a Wi-Fi stethoscope, allowing you to listen in on the conversations happening over the airwaves. But in the right hands, Aircrack Ung is an invaluable tool for testing the security of your own Wi-Fi network, identifying weaknesses and ensuring that your data is protected. So the next time you connect to a Wi-Fi network, remember Aircrack Ung and make sure your own network is secure. Let's face it, the web is a dangerous place and web applications are often the weakest link in the security chain. That's where Burp Suite comes in, the web application security testing tool that lets you intercept, inspect, and modify traffic between your browser and web servers. Think of it like a man in the middle, but for good. With Burp Suite, you can analyze web applications for vulnerabilities like SQL injection, cross-site scripting, and more. You can manipulate data being sent to and from the server, test input validation, and even automate your attacks. It's like having X-ray vision for web applications, allowing you to see the inner workings and identify potential security flaws. That's why it's crucial to only use Burp Suite on web applications you own or have explicit permission to test. But in the right hands, Burp Suite is an invaluable tool for developers and security professionals to build more secure web applications and protect user data. Databases are the heart of many web applications, storing everything from user credentials to sensitive business data. And if those databases aren't properly secured, they can be a gold mine for attackers. That's where SQL Map comes in, the open source penetration testing tool that specializes in finding and exploiting SQL injection vulnerabilities. Imagine a burglar finding a way to bypass your security system and gain access to your vault. That's what SQL injection can do to a database. With SQL Map, you can automate the process of detecting and exploiting SQL injection vulnerabilities, allowing you to retrieve data from the database, modify data, and even execute commands on the database server. That's why it's crucial to only use SQL Map on systems you own or have explicit permission to test. But in the right hands, SQL Map is an invaluable tool for security professionals to identify and fix SQL injection vulnerabilities before attackers can exploit them. Just remember, with great power, you know the drill. Last but not least, we have Nikto, the web server scanner that can help you find common vulnerabilities and misconfigurations. Think of it like a web server health check, identifying potential issues before they can be exploited by attackers. Nikto works by sending a series of requests to a web server and analyzing the responses, looking for things like outdated software, insecure configuration settings, and known vulnerabilities. It's like having a team of security experts audit your web server, but without the hefty price tag. Nikto is a valuable tool for anyone who manages a web server, from small business owners to large enterprises. By identifying and fixing vulnerabilities early on, you can significantly reduce the risk of your website being compromised. So the next time you're thinking about website security, remember Nikto and give your web server a thorough checkup. Thanks for watching. We've covered a lot of ground today from network scanning to password cracking and web application testing. Remember these commands are just tools and like any tool, they can be used for good or evil. It's up to you to use this knowledge responsibly and ethically. 
Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more tech tips and tutorials. Stay safe and happy hacking.